Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make a really fast 2x2 two two Lego vacuum engine. A lot of people are requesting me to make a tutorial on this. I actually did a little bit of research and some experimenting on making this faster, giving this maximum power. It goes pretty fast and I'm going to teach you how to show it. But first, I'm going to show you a demonstration. Here's all the pieces you need, the one circle, the pen. They can be used with different pieces. I'll explain later in the video. Here's a different view of the pieces in case you need it. The bricks in this clip the pen. You just need something that can fit a four x two x two space. This brick also depends. You're gonna need something to fill in a four x one x two space. You're gonna need two of these. These bricks can use a 2x1x1 two by one by one space. These two transparent bricks can also depend. You just need something that can fit a 4x1x2 by by space again. This beam also depends, you can also use a 5x1 beam, has to be thin though. This axle depends too, you can also use the small red axle, which also works. This Technic pin here is broken off and glued on because this was used on a different engine but you're supposed to use this on this, especially this color because this is very smooth and it can make this, this engine have lots of power. As you can see here, I'm adjusting the, the piston and valve crankshafts because these need to be at a certain angle as you can see here. You need to put it at this exact angle. For the piston head, you're going to need this exact piece and especially this flat plate without studs. This piston head is not the real piston head. The real piston head had to be glued on because the vacuum suckage kept breaking it.
for the piston sleeve, you're going to need three of these 2x1x3 by by pieces that have a really smooth wall and can make the piston move easier. Congratulations because you are now done building this engine. I'm going to test it on the vacuum. 